One question, Carl. The uh, the color of this impressive, majestic-looking sphere. Uh, the color, it's blue. Yes. Uh, why is it? There's two reasons why uh, why Neptune is blue. A very lovely, austere kind of blue to, to me. Uh, one reason, part of the reason, is the same reason that the Earth's sky is blue. And uh, this just has to do with uh, the scattering of light by, uh, by air. Uh, light of all colors comes from the sun. Uh, blue light is preferentially bounced around by the air molecules. And so that makes the sky blue in all directions. The red light doesn't get bounced around, and so it preferentially comes through. That's why when you see the sun setting, the blue light gets scattered out of the beam, the red light stays in, and the sunset looks red. And the sunset should look red on any planet which has a massive atmosphere, including Neptune. The other reason that Neptune is blue is because its air is made of a different composition than ours. And it has a, a lot of a gas called methane. And methane actually absorbs uh, red light. So it lets the blue light through. There's two different reasons why it has this beautiful color. The planet Neptune has um, an interior, correct? That somehow generates heat. What is the composition of that interior? You're asking hard questions. <laughs> we can only see the outside. Yeah. So our compositional information, direct compositional information from the light that bounces off uh, Neptune uh, is restricted only to the outside. We have a basic understanding of what kind of stuff there is in the universe and some very halting and preliminary understanding of how worlds form. And on the basis of that, we can calculate what the stuff ought to be deep inside. I don't have huge confidence in this because, you know, we've never been deep inside. The reason for the, the heat that it's giving off uh, is that, so to say, Neptune is not yet finished being formed. When planets are formed, matter is falling in, attracted by their mutual gravitational attraction. And in the case of the Earth, of course, we... It has long since completed its formation. But the gas giants are still gravitationally contracted. And the heat that is generated by this still slow collapse is thought to be responsible for what is radiating out from, uh, from Neptune.